gave instructions from the dressing room. Do you have any questions? I got a question. You got any excuses tonight, Roy? Let's not ask questions like that. Let's touch gloves and go to work. Tonight, Roy. Let's go to work. Antonio Tarver wants to correct the scoring of the first fight. <laughs> See if it belongs to Never seen it. <laughs> I got a question. You got any excuses tonight, Roy? <laughs> what a start. Oh, he's very, very confident. And there were boos in the house during the first fight from time to time. And already Jones is much more active and much more effective in round one. Tarver hadn't gotten off really, and Jones is landing his right hand. So even though much of the first round was a phony war, Tarver stalking now more aggressively, more concertedly, and seemingly accepting the role of the leader in the counterpuncher's war. And there's a hard left hand by Antonio Tarver. Jones tries to come back with a right to the body and a right upstairs and another right to the middle of the belly. Well, it's interesting. I'm watching Tava. He seems to still be giving Roy problems. Roy has not found a way still to get a sustained attack against him. And there go Jones on a hard left hand. And that is the first that Roy Jones has ever been hurt. Only Lou DeBell ever knocked him down. Jones may not get up. And he makes it up. It's and over. Jay Lady stops the fight. And Jones is still on Queer Street. And that's amazing. What a statement by Antonio Tarver. One big left hand shot. Roy Jones has gotten old. And you could see it because he was throwing one punch at a time. And he was measured by Tarver. And he, that, is, that, is, that is the first time in his career He's really been hurt. He's gone down before one time, but there was a perfect left hand. Roy never saw it coming. Roy is out, and Roy may be out of boxing. And that's why Tarver wanted to be the counterpuncher, because he answered Roy's right hand with a perfect left hand shot that knocked Jones out. There it was.